for a theatre that's at the heart of a city like Manchester, a self-producing theatre that prides itself on being progressive and about developing the next generation of theatre makers, we have to invest in young people to make that true and authentic. We put young people at the heart of a lot of the work that we do here at the Royal Exchange. Every year we work with approximately four and a half thousand young people aged between zero to 25 years. It's important that they feel safe, that they feel comfortable, that they feel valued and that they have a sense of ownership of what they're doing and where they are. When you walk in, I feel like at home, you're treated equally. It's not based off your skin colour, you know, your age. If you suit the plot, you might as well play it. It's probably the best year of my life actually. When I'm at the work exchange I feel treated like I'm treated like a professional. To get that experience, that proper theatre experience that I know a lot of teenagers like me would love, it's quite exceptional really. We see young people here flourish and grow through creative development. The personal journeys for some young people are astronomical. Last year I managed to finish a full length play which was long listed for the Brentwood Prize. It made me think I could actually do something with this. It's being taken seriously by people who actually work in the theatre and who are excited about your writing. I really loved doing Hamlet in the round um, which featured Maxine Peak. It was amazing just working with professional actors, people who've been in your position and you know see, it's very encouraging. We've done loads like looking at designing posters, writing copy, doing flyers, doing video interviews. I do a marketing internship as well and like the work that I've done here like massively was what got me that. It's, it definitely developed my confidence. Now I'm part of Young Creatives and that's a leadership programme. I'd never have thought about training to be a leader when I first started with the Royal Exchange. One of the last projects that we did involved about 40 young people delivering a talk to an audience of about 400 people. The whole event, the, the design, the delivery, the content was completely young people led. And it was an incredible success. I mean, we sold out. Uh, we had people on a huge waiting list. But it was also an important mark for us in terms of how we enable, through the work that we do, to give young people a voice. To make interesting theatre, we need to make it with an eclectic group of people. The best thing about the Young Company is there's just so many different kinds of people. People that you might not even cross paths with. It's just been like really, I guess, eye-opening. None of the work that we do really would be possible without additional funding. The investment that's made you can see the results very quickly. It's almost like a key that unlocks that potential in people. We know that theatre is one of the greatest ways for people to understand who they are and develop who they are. So it's vital that we are able to support young people to have that experience themselves. Yeah.